Okay, so on this question, we are converting some exponential expressions to logarithmic expressions. So we're changing, you know, languages from one to uno, or really it's uno back to one now. We're going from, you know, exponent, you know, normal language that we're used to, power language, to this weird log language that we're not as used to. So how does that work? Well, let me bring them the part A over here. So we have four to the second power is 16. To change between the languages, between log and exponential, what you do is you grab the base, that's the four, right? The base is the thing that has a power on it. It's the base, like the base of a statue is the bottom of a statue. It's the base, it's the bottom number. And then you do this little swish thing, just like that. And you're gonna bring in the log word. So whenever you do the swish, you change from no log to log or log to no log. You, know, you basically reverse the log situation. So it's gonna become log and that four is gonna be lowered down. Why? Because it's the base, right? Bases are lowered down. And then we'll come the 16 and then the two. See how we did that? Four, 16, two. Four, 16, two. Log base four of 16 is two. And they tell us right here, you know, I'll grab this right here. And they say, oh, write it in the form <clears throat> log base four of C equals D. So we just go, oh, okay, sure. So the C is 16, the D is two, the C is 16, the D is two. And there we go. Let's try the next one. So on the next one, <clears throat> we'll, we'll take it right here and it's, um, in fact, let me, um, might be good, might be good. Do a line of separation there, yeah. Kind of line these guys out. Whoops, that was a little, a little high, a little low. I <laughs> just did it again. All right, might be a little bit too narrow. Well, oh, I'm having a trouble with this, aren't I? All right, good enough. Here we go. All right, so uh, let's get back to it. So on this one, we are going to say 625 equals 5 to the fourth. But then we want to change it to log form. How do you do that? Well, you do the, you do the swish thing. So we're going to say, okay, 625. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I did the wrong thing. You're supposed to grab the base first, aren't we? So yeah, so let me make sure that we're clear. We're, we're going to write the word log over here, and you're going to do it by first grabbing the base. You grab the base. Whatever side it's on, right side, left side, doesn't matter. You always start with the base, and then you swish to the other side and back. So log base 5 of 625 equals 4. That makes sense how I did that? You see that? So you always start with the base and then switch to the other side and back. So the base right here, 625 and back. And so <clears throat> that's supposed to compare with, that's supposed to match up with, what does it say right here? Log base five of E. Log base five of E equals F. So then the E is clearly 625 and the F is four. E is 625 and F is four. All right, good. Let's try the next one. The next one, they go 10 to the second power is 100. 10 to the second power is 100. So now we're gonna, we're gonna change it. You, what do you grab first? You always grab first the base. So grab the base. Swish, swish. So that'll become, that'll change to log base 10. The base remains the same. The base of the log is the base of the exponential. The base is the base. Uh, but then comes the 100 and then the 2, right? How do we know? Because it tells over 10, 100, 2. 10, 100, 2. There we go. And then they want us to compare that with what? Log base 10 of G. 
log base 10 of G equals H. I see that right here. So then G is clearly 100, H is 2. G is 100, H is 2. All right, one more. Um, and so then on this last one, we're going to go right here. We're going to go zero. It's a decimal. 0 0.1 is 10 to the minus 1. I want to change it now to log form. So we're going to switch to a log. And when you change the log form, you, where do you start with? You always start with the base. Huh? Here's the base. The base is something that has a power on it. Switch to the other side and back. So the base is the base. The base of the log is the base of the power. Same thing. Base and then the 0 0.1 and then the negative 1. So 10, 0 0.1, negative 1. So there we go. So the 10, the base of 10, 0 0.1, negative 1. So we change log. And then what, what form do they want us to compare to on this one? They told us to um, compare to this. So log base 10 of J equals K. So the J is the 0 0.1, K is the negative one. J is 0 0.1, the K is the negative one. And so there we go. That's how you change from exponential form to log form.